around the city. This video is sponsored by the following English learning websites. What do you see around the city? This video will help you describe various sites and sites you might see in a city. First, let's check your vocabulary. Look at the pictures. You will have five seconds to guess and say the word in English. For example, you will see, you will say, traffic light. Ready? Let's begin. Item number one. Street. We can also say avenue. Item number two. Building or buildings. Item number three. Crosswalk. Some people might say zebra crossing because of the stripes. Item number four. Restaurant. Item number five. Supermarket. Item number six. Sidewalk. Item number seven. Intersection. Item number eight. Street light. Item number nine. Street sign or street signs. Actually, you will never see all of these street signs together in one place. Item number 10. Traffic circle. Some people might say roundabout. Here are some other things you might see around the city. Say the words for pronunciation. Bank. A bank is where you deposit money. Hospital. A hospital is a place where you go when you're sick or hurt. Gas station. A gas station is where you buy gasoline for your car. Post office. A post office is a place where you mail letters or packages. Store. A store is where you buy specialized items. For example, a computer store or a shoe store. Street market. A street market is where individual vendors sell their goods to the public. Mall or shopping mall. A shopping mall is where there are lots of shops or stores together in one place. Convenience store. A convenience store is where you can buy things 24 hours a day. Farmer's market. A farmer's market is where you can buy fruits and vegetables. Park or playground is a place where you can take kids or pets to play. Parking lot. A parking lot is a place where you can leave your car when you go shopping. Traffic jam. A traffic jam is where cars get stuck, especially during rush hour. City blocks. We use the word block to talk about square or rectangular shaped areas between streets within cities. How many city blocks do you see in this picture? Note, you can see more pictures with vocabulary words and hear the pronunciation by clicking on the link in the description below. Two, grammar, context, and conversation. Now that you have learned and practiced the vocabulary, it's time to put the words into sentences. You can use the phrases, there is and there are, to talk about city sites. Is there a post office in your city? Yes, there is a post office on Main Street. Actually, there are two post offices in my city. There's one on Main Street and one on Center Street. 
talk about sites, places, and sites, things you see in your neighborhood. In my city, town, or neighborhood, there is a shopping mall downtown. There are many shops in the mall. Talking time. Pause the video and talk with your friends about your city or neighborhood. Four, check your listening and vocabulary. Can you remember what I said about various places in the city? A bank is a place where you deposit money. A post office is where you mail letters. Complete these sentences by matching the place with the information on the right. For example, a bank is a place where you deposit money. Please feel free to pause the video so you can have more time to do the exercise. Check your answers. A bank is a place where you deposit money. A post office is a place where you mail letters and packages. A hospital is a place where you go when you're sick or hurt. A convenience store is where you can buy things 24 hours a day. A gas station is where you get gasoline for your car. A store is a place where you might buy specialized items. A farmer's market is a place where you buy fruits and vegetables. A park or playground is a place where you take kids or pets to play. A shopping mall is a place where there are lots of stores or shops. Hope that was helpful. If you enjoyed this video, please click on the thumbs up, like button below. Also remember to subscribe to our channel for more lessons like these. Have a question for our next video? If you have a question or English topic you would like to learn about in another video, please submit it at the link below. We would love to make a video especially for you. Thanks for watching. For more information, please see the links in the description below.